Hi guys, I'm Inche Karki and in collaboration with Resvol, we have come up with the perfect nighttime look. So if you like this look, keep on watching. Alright, so we're going to first start with the Face Perfecting Primer and I love how amazing this primer is. It gives me such a nice uh, glossy finish. Absolutely love it. So since this is a nighttime look, I'm going to first start with my eye makeup. So I'm just brushing out the brows. Now I'm going to fill them in. Alright, so I'm done with my eyebrows. Now just a tip that if you don't have a concealer that's like 2-3 uh, shades lighter than your natural skin tone, I do have this foundation from Resvol. Um, it's a little bit light for my skin tone, so I'm just going to use this today as my um, concealer and to also line my eyebrows and make them more prominent. So I really like this foundation as my concealer as well just because it's so light and it glides on so smoothly and the coverage as you can see is buildable. So as you can see makeup is an art. There's so much small details that you have to look into and the more precise you are about these details the more better and more beautiful your makeup is going to look. Alright, so I've done my eyebrows. Now I'm going to start with the makeup, um, eye makeup look. So I wasn't sure the type of eye makeup I wanted to do, but I know the lipstick I wanted to use. I really wanted to use the Resvol Kuyudzun Matte Lipstick so, in the shade Vampire, which is the number 14. And look how beautiful it is! It looks absolutely stunning. So I'm going to do an eye makeup which matches with this shade of lip. So let's get started. Now, I'm gonna use the Resvol Kukajo, the eye defining kajo for my eyes to make my eyes pop. So first I'm gonna apply it on the top of my... Now I'm gonna take the eyeshadow brush again, take some eyeshadow and I'm just gonna blend out the kajo that I just put on. As you can see, the kajal does not want to move, which is a very good thing because then our night out, if you go out and you know, go party or you know, some kind of event, you don't want the kajal to like smudge. So this, that's why I really love this kajal. It just stays in place, it does not move anywhere. So I'm almost done with my eye makeup and now I'm gonna use the Res Volco um, eyeliner, which is one of my favorites. I've used it uh, many times and I absolutely love it. So this is the liner and it's called the Power Liquid Liner and is dermatology tested. So that's, and it's waterproof. So which is all A pluses for me. So I'm using another liner from Resvol. This is the Ultra Sharp, sharp Pen Liner. So if you feel comfortable using a pen like um, one of pen like makeup product, then this is really good. I'm just using this because I feel like it's good tip lazy on Ademiro wing liner is sharper. So I'm just gonna use this. So I'm done with the eye makeup. I'm just gonna finish it up with some mascara. I already have the falsies on. Alright. We are done with the eye look. Now, moving on towards our face, I'm gonna use my favorite, favorite foundation and pan stick from Resvol. This is the shade, I, I've used it before as well. It's called Ivory Nude in the shade 10. And the other one is the liquid foundation from Resvol, which has, which the best part about this one is it has SPF 25. And you guys know how much I love my sun protection factor. So, and also the best thing about these is they have vitamin E and they're paraben free, which is awesome. The reason I'm mixing both is because one of them is a little too dark and the other one is a little too light. So I'm mixing it together to get the perfect shade. But Resvol has a variety of different shades. So you can definitely go and look it up and see which shade best best fits your uh, skin tone. Alright, 
So I'm gonna take the pen stick now and I'm just gonna mix it along with the foundation. The foundation that was already there. So now you can see I mixed the two foundations, one in pan stick, the other in liquid, and it just looks so beautiful. The shade, it's just combined into a really beautiful shade. Now I'm gonna take my beauty blender and just press in any excess product that might be on my skin. Why I'm doing this is because I don't want a very cakey look. I mix the concealer with a little bit of the red oil and cream just because it makes it more, it gives it a more natural finish. Now I'm gonna take the uh, Flawless Loose Powder, which is translucent from Resvol and that is my setting powder. I'm going to set my face with this. So I'm going to take a little bit. Alright, so I've baked my face and now while it's baking, I'm just going to use the pan stick contour in the shade Warm Bronze. I've used this before and it really, really warms up my face. As I take out the rest of all the pencils and powder, my makeup looks really, really set in place, which is what I want if I'm going out. Alright, so we're gonna finish up the look with the shade Vampire. Alright, guys, we are done with our makeup, so I'm just gonna set it up, set the makeup with some setting spray. <laughs> 